Hi cake friend and welcome to the Home Bakers Hive YouTube channel, a place where bakers get together to learn how to run a profitable baking business. Like, comment and subscribe and let's grow together. So many of you might be wondering how exactly you can increase your cake prices. You might even have been wanting to do this for some time now, but you are probably stuck as to what are the reasons that you would, you know, be sharing with your clients, like why, how, um, you know, all that that goes behind increasing your prices. How would you justify for that? So that is exactly what we will be talking about today. Now, there are a bunch of reasons why you should actually be increasing your prices. In fact, it's something that's probably long overdue. But how exactly do you justify that to your client? And how do you make that or how do you do that in a way that you don't lose your existing clients? It's a scary thing to do for any business owner. You know, but then it's a reality check. Like every business owner has to increase their prices at least once a year or once in a while. Now, I recommend for cake makers to increase their, um, you know, cake prices every year simply because food prices are constantly on the rise. The price for butter, the price for cooking oil, the price for whatever heavy ingredient is always on the increase. So you should also be increasing your prices unless, of course, you are having some sort of magical supply that drops down from somewhere and you don't have any costs to incur as far as that particular ingredient, ingredients or supplies are concerned. So that is why you should be increasing your prices. But then let's look at some of the practical things or the practical reasons why you should be increasing your cake prices. The first reason why you should be increasing your food prices is because your skill level has improved, okay? So this doesn't mean that um, just because you didn't attend the training recently that you should not be increasing your prices. Your skill level literally improves every time you bake and decorate, okay? So you don't have to wait for a cake training. You don't have to wait for a special training session that you need to attend in order to increase your prices. Because every time you, you know, increase, I mean, every time you bake or decorate, you are actually becoming an expert. You are getting closer to your 10,000 hours. Now, the 10,000 hour rule is one that basically asserts that the key to achieving, you know, true um, expertise in any skill is to simply or is simply a matter of practicing albeit the correct way for at least 10,000 hours, right? So if you are practicing anything for 10,000 hours, then you should be an expert or you are getting close or you are an expert in that thing. So um, the more you practice, you know, coaches always say practice makes perfect. Parents always say perfect and um, practice makes perfect. So the more you bang, the more you decorate, you are actually becoming an expert in that field, right? Or um, in, in your business. So that in itself is training. It's literally on the job training for you and your cake business. So that is one reason why you should be increasing your prices because the more you bake, the more you are, uh, or the more years you cover in your baking business, the more expertise you are actually building up. And um, hence, you actually having a legitimate reason to increase your prices. Um, another one is if you've attended any sort of training or if you've invested in any form of coaching um, or training, business training or mentorship, then that is also another reason why you should be increasing your prices because you've actually gained a new skill set. Set, and that is contributing to your um, overall business success. And so you need to cut for that cost. And yet another reason to increase your prices. Reason number two why you should be increasing your um, cake prices is because food prices are constantly increasing. Okay. So we will always have inflation. There's also deflation where food prices or pr overall price levels in the um, overall economy um, are decreasing over time. That happens too. But mostly these days we are talking about inflation, right? Um, and food prices are always increasing, not just food prices. Fuel prices are increasing. Prices for accommodation um, are increasing. Um, your utility bill is always increasing. Um, the repo rate in your country is probably increasing or the bank rate is probably increasing. So prices are constantly increasing and that is affecting your business, whether it's a home baking business or not, right? Maybe you have a storefront. And if you have a storefront, the more, um, you know, you then have a better reason to increase your prices. Even though you are a home baking business owner, you still need to increase your prices because of inflation, because it's ultimately affecting you. So because of general um, inflation in the economy, you should also be increasing your prices. So that is reason number two. 
Reason number three why you should be increasing your cake prices is because you need to get paid. Darling, did I say that on not? Okay. <laughs> You need to get paid from your baking business, okay? And I know that um, many baking business owners probably confuse getting paid with making a profit, right? So getting paid is actually incorporated into your cost. And profit should also be worked in into your costs, right? So if you're having any form of confusion around this, please make a good investment in the cake, um, you know, costing and the cake um, pricing training that I have. I tell you or teach you how to work out your profit margin, um, how to work out your um, labor hours and all that. And um, there's also a cake uh, pricing calculator that, that, that comes with that. It's a bundle. I'll leave a link um, down below to that so you can go ahead and um, go check that out. It's not free. That one is not free. But then um, I also have a free cake pricing guide. Um, that one doesn't really help you work out a profit margin, but it should really help you to work out um, a decent price for your cakes. It is a very useful tool. So you need to get paid, right? As a cake maker, as an entrepreneur, as a business owner, you need to get paid. So you are not just covering for the cost of your ingredients, but you are also, you know, incorporating, you need to incorporate your labor costs and you also need to uh, incorporate a profit margin. So your business needs to get something, you as an entrepreneur need to get something and then you need to cover for your overheads and your overall expenses in your baking business. So that is another reason why you need to increase your cake prices so reason number four why you should increase your cake prices so you can finally start investing in your baking business now investing in your baking business might take several forms right it might look something like buying or purchasing that coaching course that you've always wanted um purchasing that um training that you've always wanted to go to, getting a um, Kenwood mixer, um, you know, buying some supplies um, in bulk or just expanding your business or getting that extra help that you need so much. It might take different forms. But as an entrepreneur, you definitely need to invest back in your business and your profit margin basically covers for that. Your profit margin makes room for you to be able to invest in your baking business. So those are the four reasons that I have for you today why you should actually increase your cake prices. Reason number one is because your skill level has improved and your skill level does not only improve because you've went to a cake training of some sort, it also increases because you've been in business for a long time. So that is one reason why you should be increasing your you know, cake prices. Reason number two is because of inflation, food prices and prices in the overall economy are increasing over time. And so your business needs to follow suit. You need to at least increase your prices, uh, ladies and gentlemen, once a year because inflation is always going it is it doesn't you know food prices are not a stagnant they are always moving up um, and if there's any form of deflation maybe you could consider a reduction in your prices but honestly you know that hardly happens so let's increase those cake prices reason number three is to cover your expenses um to get paid and then reason number four is so you can invest back in your business i hope that these tools um, and tips were useful i hope you're gonna go and implement some of what you learned in today's video i will see you in the next one don't forget to like and to subscribe bye for now